My name is Tomás O'Leary, I'm a founder of the Passive House Academy and our role in this Brighton Green project is as the Passive House Building Certifying Body. We are accredited by the German Passive House Institute to certify Passive House buildings and this project behind me is an, ex is an excellent example of one here in New York. I'm actually very fortunate that I live in a passive house building myself, so I've got a very good insight into what these residents will enjoy. They're going to enjoy superb comfort, fantastic indoor air quality, and the sense of security and well-being that their energy bills going forward will be zero. Okay, so I built uh, the first certified passive house in the English-speaking world. It happens to be in Ireland, uh, so that's where, that's where I live uh, some of the time, and the rest of the time I live here in the US. So our role in all this is making sure that the building complies with the Passive House standard and that involves us working with the architect and the design team to make sure that the, the envelope, uh, the mechanical ventilation system, the windows, the air tightness, that they all sort of combine together to meet the, this Passive House standard which is the most energy efficient standard on the planet. So our role is, if you like, is like an overseeing role and a quality assurance role. Brighton Green can definitely show us uh, the way forward for highly sustainable uh, projects um, because this project for example will have a 90% saving on energy consumption compared to normal buildings. It collects and harvests and cleans its own water. It generates its own electricity from photovoltaic panels and it also generates its own domestic hot water from solar thermal collectors. So it's an, ex it's an excellent example as to how we need to build in the future. So the people who are going to live in this uh, apartment are extremely lucky because um, they'll benefit from all the, the wonderful uh, attributes that Passive House brings. So for example, they'll have phenomenally low uh, energy bills, maybe even no energy bills. They'll have superb comfort both in the winter when it'll be warm and in the summer when it'll be cool. And perhaps the number one benefit will be the indoor air quality, which has been proven in Passive House projects to be extremely good. So my impression is that Brighton Green is going to be uh, an opinion leader, if you like, or a mind changer in this neighborhood here. It, it's standing up tall and proud, and it's almost like a lighthouse project, a beacon project, if you will, which is going to inspire others to think about their energy consumption, the health of their buildings, uh, the sustainability of their projects. So I think it's going to be a fantastic neighbor. So the thing about passive houses is they're extremely stable in terms of their performance. So whether we get a period of extremely hot weather or extremely cold weather, or in fact even extremely windy weather, the passive house envelope is so constructed that it can deal with pretty much anything that nature can throw at it. So I'm very, very confident that this project behind me is going to be one that can actually be fight in whatever nature throws at it. Yeah, without question, this is part of an urban residential revolution. We've been building uh, projects uh, for far too long, which frankly are uh, seriously polluting the environment, are not comfortable and are not even healthy. So this is really genuinely part of an urban revolution.